Welcome sa sipline.com. In the previous video, ay pinag-aralan natin yung equivalent fractions, no? Ngayon, ay gagamitin natin yung equivalent fractions para mag-compare ng dalawang fractions, no? So, recall lang, yung pag nag-compare tayo ng similar fractions or fractions with the same denominator, for example, 3 fourth and uh, 1 fourth, well, obvious na mas malaki yung 3 fourth kasi Sinabi na, sinasabi natin na 3 out of 4 dun sa 1 out of 4. So, mas madali siyang i-compare, no? However, kung mag-compare tayo ng, for example, 2 third and 3 fourth, no? Hindi kanun kadali yung uh, pag-compare natin because they have uh, different uh, denominators. Ang tawag natin sa kanila ay um, dissimilar fractions. So, these are dissimilar, dissimilar fractions, no? Ito ang titignan lang natin yung uh, numerator, no? kung alin yung mas malaki, kasi similar sila. No? So, these are similar fractions. So, ngayon, para makumpare natin, natin tong dalawang ito, we have to uh, get the equivalent fractions of the two uh, fractions. No? So, ang equivalent fractions ng two-third, no? ay 2 third what else? Para makuha natin, i-multiply natin ito ng 2, then ng 2, di ba? So, magiging 4, 6, what else? Multiplied by 3, this is 3 ninth, this is uh, by 4, uh, sorry. This is 6 ninth, this is 8, 12, this is uh, 10 times 5 na ito, no? So, 15. No? 10 15th and times 6 is 12 over 18th, no? And also, the equivalent fractions of, these are equivalent fractions. So, makakuha natin yung equivalent fractions by multiplying the fractions ng same number dun sa numerator and denominator. So, 2 third times 2, 2 third times 3, 2 third times 4, 2 third times 5, 2 third times 6, no? Also, yung 3 fourth, we have 3 fourth times 1, times 2, this is 6, 8, times 3, this is um, 9, 12, and times 4, this is 12, 16, times 5 is 15, 15, 20, over 20, no? So, ang hahanapin natin is yung uh, fractions na pareho yung denominator, no? So, in this case, we have 9, 12, and 8, 12, okay? So, ibig sabihin nito, yung 2 third natin ay equivalent siya sa 8, 12, no? At ang 3 fourth natin ay 9, 12. So, since equivalent fractions sa sila, no? Nung, nung mga fractions sa taas at pareho na sila ng um, denominator, these are alre already similar fractions. So, kinonvert natin yung um, dissimilar fractions into similar fractions para mas compare natin sila. So, dito alam na natin that uh, no? uh, 9, 12 is... Uh, less than or greater than 812 or one way of saying it is that 812 is less than 912 okay so another way also of uh, doing this although hindi pa natin napag is to convert them into decimal no so ang two third ay 0 0.66 no uh, never ending ano yan decimal at yung uh, three fourths naman ay 0 0.75 no so obviously 0 0.75 is greater than 0 0.66 or one way of saying it is 0 0.66 is less than 0 0.75 okay so kung makikita ninyo kinonvert natin itong mga fractions na to uh, yung 2 3rd and 3 4th into uh, similar fractions by getting their equivalent fractions no? na pareho yung kanila uh, denominator uh, this is example 1. Pwede nating 
gawin also no halimbawa ay um, two fifths and one sixth for example no so ang two fifths ang equivalent fraction sa ay two fifths what else times two is four tenth times three is six fifteenth uh, what else times 4 is 8, 20, and then 8 over 20, 10 over uh, 25, what else, times 6, 12 over 30, no? and then you want 6, it's 1, 6, 2, uh, 2, 12, this is 3 18 4 over 24 5 over um, 6 times 5 no 1 times 5 6 times 5 is 30 so obviously uh, 1 2 fifth is greater than 1 6 dito dahil ang 2 fifth natin ay equivalent siya sa 12 over 30 no so, ito yung magkapareho, no? Tsaka ito. So, this is 12 over 30, no? And this is 5 over 30. So, obviously, mas malaki yung 2 fifth or mas malaki yung 12 over 30 sa 5 over 30. Okay? So, yan yung gamit ng equivalent fractions. And later, sa mga later lessons, makita nyo na uh, gamit din natin yung uh, equivalent fractions sa pag-add ng fractions. For example, ito, 2 fifths plus 1 sixth, gagawin natin siyang similar fractions. Pwede tayo mag-add dito. No? So, yan yung gamit ng uh, equivalent fractions. Maraming salamat and uh, gusto ko kayong invite sa sipnayan.com. Nandito yung mga listahan ng videos natin. No? Uh, yung pagkakasunod-sunod, mas maganda kung mapanood nyo siya ng sunod-sunod. And if you're in YouTube, uh, pwede nyong, uh, pwede kayo mag-subscribe sa, uh, by, by clicking the subscribe button doon sa baba ng video natin. Pakishare nyo itong mga videos na inyo sa inyong mga friends, no? Para matuto din sila dito sa mga videos natin. Maraming salamat and see you in the next tutorial.